Yo, what's going on guys? JBH here and welcome back to MLB The Show 18 where today we are heading up to Denver to take on the Colorado Rockies and of course as you can see there we have the main man Jacob deGrom on the mound 7-3, 2.55 ERA. Now last time out we managed to finally get our win. It was, fir it was like the first win in like three weeks or something ridiculous that we've had. I, I do simulate through most of the games because, I mean, I literally do not have time to play a game every single night, but we finally managed to get a wind. And moving between then and now, we have made a few changes to our uh, roster. I've tried to update it to the most accurate sort of lineup that the Mets have right now. Of course, we want to keep all the players that we have that are not injured like most of them are in real life, so I didn't change that, but... Um, I have decided to make some changes, uh, so between now and the last game, I think the only change is actually on the bench, it's not actually, our starting nine are the same, obviously, well, besides, of course, the pitcher, actually, no, we did play with DeGrom last time out, which is ironic, and he did go 120-something ridiculous pitches, so I did use him way too much than, uh, than what I should have. Alright, so it would seem that all the all our <laughs> players that we decided to sign between uh, the last game. So I signed Bautista, the ex-Toronto uh, player, and then another guy from the Reds. I've forgotten his name. It was just there. So, yeah, no, we'll be playing them today, apparently, as well. So <laughs> there is a couple of changes to line up. So I just, and they'll be doing all the sort of auto roster changes, as I've said it to. But yeah, no, if we can get a win today, I'll be pretty happy. Hope you guys enjoy it. This one is going to be fun. On a balmy summer night in the Rocky Mountains, the show comes to you from Coors Field in downtown Denver. Tonight, the second of four to begin the week between the New York Mets and the Colorado Rockies. Josh Cowan makes his big league debut right after this. Chad Bettis will be on the bump for game two of the series. Dan Plezak, what's the word on him? Hey, coming off his last start where he threw a no-hitter. Let's see how he backs that one up. How long will this no-hit bid continue? Now at the plate, Jose Reyes. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. All right, come on, Jose. Make it a good start. Here's the first pitch to him. And we are. Nice. Straight away center field. And a great diving yes. effort there, but it'll just tip off his glove, and it's a base hit. All right, there it is. First base hit. Five pitches in. Got a bit lucky, but I'll take it. Here's your one assessment. As you get a look at his current right, yeah, he's a big man. Splits entering play in this one. Uh, when Cespedes isn't injured, we are on the money, but when he is, it's like all hope, <laughs> hope is lost. Come on. He's set. Here it comes. Loop oh, down drilled. Short. And that's in there. Base hit. And the throw will go to second as they get the force out. Wow, they got the force out on that? Oh, man. God, he hit it so hard. It, that he sucks. Hit base hit to the outfield, but then all of a sudden the throw comes in and they get the force on the plate. To be honest, that just can't happen. What the hell, man? God, could I get any more unlucky? Like, I think it's just the 2007. Yeah, he has turned himself into a really nice ball player. I wouldn't put him on a superstar level, but you know. And the throw is All right, well, there it is. Three outs. I mean, that second that's one was a bit ridiculous. I don't quite know how that happened, up. but we've got no score. I hope I haven't accidentally switched off like auto base running. I mean, I've got it to assisted. That was weird. Jacob Degrom is ready to go as he'll be on the mound for the Mets. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, we don't see very many guys finish what they started. He almost did in his last one, getting into the ninth inning to earn the win in his last start, and they'd love to get another eight-plus innings out of this guy here today. At the plate, DJ LeMahieu. He'll lead things off here in the bottom for strike one. 
Oh one. Here's the pitch. And now a bunt oh, attempt nice here bunt. as he gets this one down. And he nah, that was never gonna happen. Barehanded attempt, so that ought to be scored as a bunt single. Batting third. Here's Charlie. Got him. Swing there as they tie nice. him up inside for the third strike, and the inning is over. Second inning upcoming here in Denver with no score. Next up for New York, Josh All right. Cowan. He is the newbie. Not really viewed as a big time prospect coming out of the draft. He's had to prove himself at every step nice. of the way to get to this point. His one pitch, one hit. Back. Yeah, what a monster moment for not only And the himself, debutant is family, on first. Nice. That have helped him along the way. This is a monumental moment in his career. And there's probably no happier person in the ballpark. Josh Cowan has just collected his first hit in the big leagues. And as is customary, there's the ball being sent into the dugout. Someone will tuck it away for him to put in his trophy case. Yeah, good for him and congratulations. Listen, he's worked his entire uh, lifetime for this. That? He'll never have obviously trying a to batting average cool right better now, than this. <laughs> 100 right now. He's on top of way. This oh, is Luke God damn it. Third. And plenty of time over there at third to get a glove up, and there are two down. All right, come on, Jose, again. just send Jose it, mate. He popped out in his first trip. Uh, oh, and this one is Jesus! Right field. Nothing's gonna stop it. Good and night. Gone up into the second deck. Well, I told him to send it. I didn't think he was gonna send it that far. A solo home run for one Jose nil Reyes. Mets. Career homer number 149, and the Mets are on the board first, one to nothing. Well, he was on cruise control, just needing one more. 435. But he came up with a plan. Base is empty. That's big one. He didn't have to think about shooting Damn. one to the opposite field. Second or tier. Or the swing to move the runners. He just wound up and let her rip. A solo shot is the result. Here's Juan Ligares. Slash oh, and Juan's on base way. as well. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. That's so we'll hold late on inning charge. The late in the right. inning charge. Get two hits for him <laughs> here this evening. As we check out the top Mets in that department, you can currently see he's third best on the yeah, ball. That's why our, they. Well, that's why those three are our one, two, three. Yet yeah. <laughs> tongue twister and all. Into the box now, Yoenis Cespedes. Wow, so Yoenis didn't get counted that hit because around. fucking Lagares didn't make it on base. God damn it. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Hit sharply oh. on the ground. Well, he's definitely going to get that hit and now. He will continue as that's through for a two out hit. This guy's just throwing so many hittable strikes, uh, strikes. It's just whether or not I can actually get to them. Two on, two out for him here in the third. Come on, Todd Father. To him on the way. Oh, he's that got that in as well. And that's in there. Base hit. Loaded him up on. Boy, after that base knock right there. Two outs. Wow. His hitting streak to Three base hit, yeah, <laughs> base hits in a row. They're just sitting right there to be hit. All right, and the, here's the deb <laughs> debutant to try and clean him up. Come on, Josh. Not trying to do too much. First pitch on its way. Oh, he's hit him. Hit by the pitch. And that'll be a wow, what a turn of events. And time will be called here as the pitching coach heads out to the mound and hopefully try On two outs, I don't think I've ever bit. scored a run having no one on base from two outs before. That's incredible. Fight back Come on, inside Wilma. with another fastball. I know he hit the last guy, but if he's going to have success... Oh, that's been hit well. Establish that pitch in. Oh, not far no. enough. Damn it. Puts it away as I've gotten so close to hitting a grand slam. I've never scoreboard. hit one before on MLB. So just... two, but it could wow, six hits, two runs. The bases loaded. Well, we have the lead. That's all that matters. Half of inning number three. It's the Mets two and the Rockies nothing. That's it to short. Does he Come have on. Oh, what are you, why do you keep running over it? it gets the hell? Out there and that'll let the inning continue. Ah, my God. Hey, there's another. 
swing and a soft liner nice. down the line in right. That's in another base hit. He's two for two. Damn it. So now they'll have runners on the wing at that one. A good take there on that pitch. The 2 1 home. Smoke toward the hole. Cabrera's there. Get him out. Yes. First, and the Rockies fail to catch well done. him. That ends the inning. Dance oh, in. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Here's oh, that's been hit really well. Deep. Wow. Over the that has been sent miles. Home run. Well, we just hired this guy from, I think it was the Reds, and wow. So a solo First game with the Mets, and he scores a homer. <laughs> first home run of the season, and the Mets have taken Two a homers three tonight. To lead. Man, turning out to be a good game. I wonder how far that one went. Here's Juan Lagares now. He's got a base hit tonight. He's in to get things going here in inning number five. Juan Lagares. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Takes this nice. the other way to right. And Loving these one pitch the hits now that we can actually find the gaps. I mean, there's no secret right now. There's a fight at the bat rack. Everybody wants up at the plate right now. They're feeling frisky. They're all pulling the trigger early, and it's working. Yeah, just didn't quite get sweet contact on that. Thing is, he hasn't walked anyone yet. That tells me he's throwing strikes, nice. but he's just not throwing enough quality strikes. Oh, that's a big double. And that's into the gap and should be extra bases. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. And another he's going to get there. As this is now a four nothing big RBI game. double from Cespedes. Well, this wow. Is a lesson for all those out there. And that was when just a contact the swing. Man on base, it always comes back to haunt you. With no outs, I thought they might hold the runner at third, but they send him anyway, and the run scores. Fastball right there, trying to tie the hitter up, trying to keep him from getting those arms extended. Oh, straight up the middle. Pitch. And that's through there into center field, base hit. And they'll get it in quickly. It's first and third now with nobody out. Hey, guys, this, he's not known for being a singles hitter right here, but that's his second knock of the game. And I'm sure he'll take him, but the guys on the other side of the scorecard might be thinking. Oh, he's going to get another one, and he's going to get an RBI. So that's two for two. Wow. What a start to your MLB career. That was awesome. First game in the majors, and he's making his well, presence felt. This guy's staying in the squad. In his many at bats, impressive stuff. Matty, what this guy's doing is unbelievable right here. The ability to slow the game down, his first big league start, and to be able to have two. And they're finally going to switch him out. That is huge. He's set. Here it comes. Bouncer up the middle. Stopped on the slide by LeMayhew. Hats off to that All right, one. You got the RBI. Time. For this lineup through the first half of the game. Yeah, they haven't had any momentum going to the plate so far in this one, Matt. They need something to break their way and wake wow. them up a bit. Nice one pitch and he's on deck. I mean, he's on base, sir. Well. <laughs> two and two. Line drive oh my God! He's got field. another one in, and that'll get down for a base hit. All right, I'm actually going to go to the bullpen now. Digging in and look. First pitch coming, here it is. And he gets around oh, on one, shit. And hits it high and deep to straightaway right. And that is off the oh wall my God. in right field. Finland rounds third and is digging for the plate. He will score. And they're on the board, it's six All to right, one. So unfortunately, I had to give up a the big double there. His pitches effectively until now. Working the edges, painting the corners, but he left this one right over the plate. Hung up there for a long time. With an RBI extra base hit right there. Errors in the ball game for the Rockies thus far. Bounced softly in front of the plate. Throw to first Money. Easily and the side is retired. There it is, and that'll probably be the end of the ground for tonight. The Rockies 
80 pitches in only 5 innings. He ran 120 the other night, so I think we'll have to switch him out, save him for another game. I can't believe we didn't catch that. I mean, it was a tough catch, but still. <laughs> the Mets make it a good one. Ground ball oh, nice. Up the middle. A diving try, but One pitch and he's on outfield. base again. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Jose Reyes, he homered back in the third inning in this one. Here comes the first pitch. And this is on That's the ground. That's double play. Fuck. LeMahieu. On to first, and return the double play. Stupid pitch to swing at. Fucking hell. The 1 0. Now a ball hit hard. Get down. A leaping yes. Fly, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. He hit the corner and tries for third. The relay throw. Oh, a triple. In there with a triple. Wow. Last pitch was a fastball. And the guards has changed this one around far out. Gets turned around. Two nice outs, self a double play, and boom. Right back in it. Alright, now it's Cespedes turn to have another go. Standing in now, Yoenis Cespedes. He oh, he's done it again. He has done it again. Field, Another and RBI. From third as they extend their wow. Lead. He took that back right where it came from. Nice ribby knock right up the shoot. There. Yeah, a little bit frustrating as a pitcher. You know, you always hear that, hey, you want to make yourself one of the defenders. But that ball was hit just out of his reach. Right up the middle, base hit, and another run batted in. Beautiful. Just about got down for it. That's all it took. Here's Todd Frazier now. A swing. Oh, that's been hit hard. The that's been hit really hard. And trouble it it's is. not going to make it, but it'll be a triple. Bases. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. And, and this will, will just run in easily. Run easily. Beautiful. And that just RBI it. double, it's 8 1. one Bloody eight. hell, what is going on today? Out of trouble, but then serves up it's a amazing mistake. what happens when you can actually land stuff. And the hitter is in scoring position. On Power second. swing. Barely left the ground, but it was hit hard. 106 miles an hour. And now the big debutant is up again. The box, Josh Cowan, he oh, he's done it again. Back in there, base <laughs> hit. Gonna oh, no, we're not going to run home. Probably should run home. Put the brakes on here as they didn't want a chance at Another base hours. hit. This game is unbelievable sometimes, Dan. There's a bullet knock right there. You're expecting an RBI. He almost hit it too good. He can't even score. Boy, too good is it, Mark. This is one right here. It just kind of gets out. 96, yeah. That was tough. Here's a okay, dink, 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 dink. ball out to right. Yes. In there, a base hit. Lucky. <laughs> five for five now for the guys. They have not been able to get him out. This is now a five-hit ball game for him here, and those don't come along every day. Just bounced in time. I'm surprised he didn't die for it. And it looks like the batter has a much better idea of what he's looking yes. for after that second pitch. Now it's yes. Tough, but he can't get there, and this is going to be trouble out there in left center. No, no, what are you doing? Second now, headed for third. Oh, for fuck's and sake. And they got him hung up out there between second and third. And they'll tag him what out What the fuck? Second. Why did you stop at second? Oh, my God, man. It was an obvious triple, you dickhead. Come set and the 0-1. Pitch outside the throw. Yes. Not in time. Pretty close, but he got in there. Slightly off the plate. Oh, that helped. Again. Pitch yes. Toward the right side. And a base hit, and that'll get the run in from third. The 1-1. One, one. It's hit very oh, well to shit. right. This one's hammered, and it's going to go. That one is gone. I cannot seem to get accurate with Ramos right now. He just 
It was the last week or the week before with the Braves where he gave up like three runs in one game and basically lost the game for us. It was just horrible, but yeah, I just cannot get it going with AJ Ramos right now. Big homer right there. Well, they're not there yet, but a solo homer to lead off the inning will do wonders for any team's confidence. We'll see if the next few batters can continue the comeback effort here. Slap hard the oh, another way. one. Oh, Solid what fucking Jesus. For him, his Got that one wrong. The afternoon. Around second, he's on his way to third. And he is in there. Yeah, first a home run. God and damn it, Joseph, come on. The pattern holds. The next hitter will rope a double to bring another run home here. God, that just see. completely, like, screwed in my head there. I thought it was curving back to me. Obviously not. Minor lapse in concentration. That's all that happens. <laughs> liner towards short money what a game so jesus christ so much went on nine to three that's i mean in the scheme of things it's not that big of a score but for us it is i mean that's the first uh, well one of the few times this year where we've scored more than like six or seven runs and big game a lot of confidence success is never guaranteed in this game so you have to appreciate it when it comes nine to three the final tally here in this one New York led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Jacob DeGrom earns his eighth victory of the season. Chat Bettis struggled and gets the loss after giving up six earned. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. Well, there it is. What a game. Four for five for Cespedes. Unfortunately, he was uh, not given that final hit because Ligares decided not to run to third on that triple. But five for five for Ligares in the end. Uh, three runs, two RBIs for Cespedes. Big homer for Reyes, uh, for Jose, even though he only got one for five in the end. But four for five for Todd Frazier. Just an awesome hitting game all around. I mean, 19 hits. I don't think I've ever seen more than, you know, maybe 10 or 11, but that's crazy. They actually scored 10 hits in the end, Colorado, and managed to bounce in three runs with a lucky homer there in the uh, eighth. But, yeah, all in all, really fun game. And as you heard it, four in a row now. So definitely moving up into that wild card spot. I mean, we're still quite away behind the Nats, so still a long way to go in this season to try and get to the top of the division. But at this rate, this is finally, I think, the uh, sort of run that we were looking for. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed it. I know it's definitely one of the best games that I've personally played this year. And until next time, I'll catch you later.